Please be a treat. Please be a treat. Please be a treat. Every artifact has a story to tell, including this beautiful model train. We have this sleek steam locomotive from 1950 with its 442 wheel configuration, which means it has four wheels in the front, four in the middle, and two in the back. The wheel configuration identifies the size of the locomotive. The AT and SF boxcar from 1948, the caboose, from 1947, and this railroad crossing signal with gate from about 1955. Each of these train models were made by Lionel Manufacturing Company, which was founded in 1900 and is perhaps the most well-known toy train manufacturer. They are all O-gauge models with the scale at 148. Model trains come in many different sizes called scale, which is its relative size in proportion to the real thing. So you would need 48 of this model steam engine to equal the length of one real one. Gauge refers to the distance between the rails, inside to inside. So standard gauge for real trains is about four feet, eight and a half inches. Scaled down to 148, O-gauge model trains run on tracks that are one and a quarter inch wide. When the first train models were made, they were not built to any one scale or standard, meaning different trains couldn't work together like with our model here. With their rise in popularity in the early 1900s, standard scales were developed for model train manufacturers, so trains would be compatible with each other, allowing consumers to collect a variety of cars and locomotives, creating their very own special model train. Although no longer as popular, Lionel trains are still manufactured today. Every artifact has a story to tell. What's the story? Stay tuned as we take flight with our next artifact. And don't forget to visit the Artifacts of Wonder page to learn more about the Science Center's collections.